Hello everyone, my name's Jack Sorrell, and today I'm going to show you how to homebrew your Wii U on firmware version 5.5.2. Homebrew on the Wii U has changed and improved a whole lot since the last time I made a video on it, which was around 7 months ago now. One of the biggest and most important changes I've noticed is that it crashes far less often now. You only had about a 40% chance of making it through to the Homebrew launcher back then. We don't know the exact success rate for this version of Homebrew, but I'd say it's around 90-95%. to Before we get started, let's go over what we're going to need. All you'll really need is an SD card and an SD card adapter, unless your PC already has a card slot built in. Keep in mind you won't be able to use SD cards which are over 32GB in capacity. I'll be using a 4GB card in this video. But now let's get started. And remember to leave a like on this video and subscribe if it helped you out. I make new Nintendo homebrew videos every Sunday. First of all, head over to your PC and type in your browser's URL bar jacksorel.tv or click the link which is down below. Up in the tutorials drop down menu, click Wii U, then click the download button for this is copy this Wii U folder to the root of the Wii U SD card. We're now in the Homebrew Launcher. Now let's open the Homebrew App Store, which I pre-installed into the Homebrew files you downloaded. The Homebrew App Store is pretty much exactly what it sounds like. It lets you download, install, update and delete Homebrew apps from your Homebrew Launcher, all without having to mess around with your PC and SD card. As you can see, there's hundreds of Homebrew apps available to download. Let's go with our loader. This lets you play disc games which aren't made for your Wii U's region. When you find the app you want, just tap it, then tap get, and it will download and install the app to your homebrew launcher. To exit the homebrew app store, just press the home button. 